for today's video I'm going to be showing you my makeup collection for autumn slash fall 2016. This video is so highly requested every single day so I thought it's about time I did it and the reason why I'm doing this is to say a massive thank you for 14,000 subscribers. I can't thank you all enough, it is insane. I'm honestly not trying to brag or show off in any way. Like I said, this was very requested. To some people, I may have a small collection and to others, I may have a large collection. But without further ado, here is my makeup so collection. I my makeup in the Alex Nine Drills from Ikea. I believe they're about 90 pound and I've had these for over a year now and I absolutely love them. And then I just wanna point out things like my mirror and my eye brushes are actually on top of my chest of drawers. I just, of course, have my skewer pot with my brushes in. The the brushes really haven't changed much since last time. I then just have this big S light up, it is on but because it's quite bright you can't really see it and this is just from Primark. I then just have this clear plastic storage container and in here I have the majority of my baby lips and then I have some of the mini benefit products such as some of the bare arms and the tints. And then over here I just have my Zoella hand cream and my Mercy Handy facial spray. I then have a sleek matte me in birthday suit, my Kylie Jenner lip kit in Dolce K and my NYX butter gloss in vanilla cream pie. So the first draw is my face draw. So the first thing I have are just primers. This is the W7 Prime Magic um, Anti Redness. I then have the Miss Sporty Insta Glow Primer and my Maybelline Baby Skin. I also have another primer back there. And then have the Super Drug CC Cream in the shade Light, the Rimmel Matte BB Cream and the Insta Glow Foundation. I have the W7 Skin Fresh Foundation and two Rimmel Foundations, the Lasting Finish and the Wake Me Up. And then again, I have the Nivea Men Post Shave Balm, which is also used as a primer. Back down here, I have a lot of mini products. So I have a mini of the Benefit Professional License to Blot and a mini of the actual Professional since my big one ran out. I then have the Elf all over colour stain and have the Rimmel Stay Blushed in number one. Then just have a bubble blush back here. This is the purple one and then I have the Technic highlight. Then in this container I tend to have like some concealers and other products. So I have the Wet n Wild Coverall Stick, the um, Models Own Tea Tree Concealer. I have the Collection Lasting Perfection. Um, the Rimmel Stay Matte Concealer and Benefit Fake Up and then finally I just have the W7 Light Diffusing One. I then have this City Colour Correct and Perfect um, Concealer Palette, the Maybelline Jelly Glow Blush and another Benefit Professional um, product. Which aside here I have the City Colour Highlight to Trio and I also have the Makeup Revolution Blush Palette in All About Blush or Pink. I think it's pink. So down here I have the Essence Silky Touch Blush in number 70, Kissable. I also have my W7 Setting Spray and then an I Heart Makeup Bronzer just in the standard shade. I then have the W7 Candy Floss Blusher, the Miss Forty Anti Spot So Clear Press Powder, the Collection Press Powder, the Rimmel Stay Matte, the MUA Shimmer Highlighter in a Iridescent Gold, the W7 Glow Promotion which is just this really nice champagne-y um, kind of highlighter. I then just have two more of the box blushes and then a highlighter all from I Heart Makeup. I have three MUA blushes in Lolly, Candy Floss and I can't remember the other shade but I do have a Makeup Revolution one here in the shade now and then I have the W7 um, multi blush in Hot Gossip which just looks like that. And then I just have this Lunatic Cosmetics Mystifying um, Mattifying white press powder which is really really nice as it's translucent and then I also have the Benefit Feeling Dandy set with just the dandelion blush in there. The next draw here is my eye draw. Now this ranges from eyeshadow palettes to single eyeshadows, mascaras, eyeliners, brow products etc. It's very full and compact and I'm contemplating whether or not putting all my palettes in another drawer. So let me know what you think I should do because I do have space for it to go in another drawer. In this first tub I have my mascaras. So on the top usually it's the mascaras I use the most, so I just have some from Collection. These two are my favourite waterproof ones. I have my favourite mascara at the moment, which is the MAC False Lashes Extreme Black. Two W7 mascaras, also waterproof and absolute lashes. I have the Essence um, All Eyes on Me mascara. I have some mini Benefit mascaras and primers in here as well. Another Rimmel one, this is the Volume Times 10 mascara, and this is in brown. I have a mini of the Roller Lash, a mini of the Givenchy um mascara i don't know which one this is i then have more collection mascaras 
down here and I also have a L'Oreal um, false lash superstar. In this small container here I have things like cream eyeshadows, primers and just single eyeshadows as well and some eyeliners and other products. So I have down here two Make a Revolution eyeshadows in Mountains of Gold and then just like a nude shade which is in the shade Touch Me. I have the Maybelline Eye Studio eyeshadow and this is in Chocolate Chip. I have a Kiko eyeshadow in 39 and I have the Natural Collection Duo in Mocha and Latte. I don't have my MAC eyeshadow in Expensive Pink which is a really nice pinky red shade. I then have the W7 Get Set eyeshadow primer and then two colour tattoos in on and on bronze and pink gold. I have some other eye products. I have the collection Work the Colour Eyeshadow Pencil in Vanilla Sky. I have the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Strawberry Milk. The Make Me Shimmer, um, the Shimmer Stick, which is from Saturated Colour. I have the Collection Extreme 24 Hour Fell Tip Liner. The Essence Long Lasting Eyeliner or Eye Pencil in Hot Scorch. And then finally the Collection Glam Crystals in number five. Down the side here I have the majority of my palettes. So I just have the Revlon Colour Stay Quad in number 500. I have my Wet n Wild palette in Walking on Eggshells. I then have some W7 palettes. I have Bronze Queen and back here I have In The City. And in between that I have the Collection Little Mix All About The Eyes palette. I also have a City Colour one in the shade Smoky. The Makeup Revolution um, Iconic Redemption Palette 3 and the Models Own Dare to Bear back here which is beautiful and this is my latest palette and I absolutely love it. In the back I have three more palettes. So I have the Danny um, just palette. I don't know if this has like a specific name. I have the W7 Beat It palette which again just has some really nice natural shapes in there and the Technic palette. I can't remember the name of this but this just has loads of eyeshadows, lip glosses, blushes, bronzes etc. And then down the side here I have all my brow products. So I just have the Benefit Give Me Brow, I have the Smudge Eyebrow Pencil in Blonde, I have my MAC Eyebrow Pencil in Lingering, the City Colour Bold Brow Gel and the Benefit um, Ready Set Brow. This is just a sample Final drawer, it's probably my favourite drawer and this is my lip drawer. So I have all my EOS going up the side, majority of my other lipstick and things like that, my favourite lipsticks here and a bunch of other liquidy lipstick products and things like lip balms in here. So. In this small container from Tiger, I have my three MAC lipsticks. I have Creme Cut, which is just this really nice pinky shimmery shade. I then have Angel, which again is a pink shade, but a little bit more matte. And this one is a frost lipstick. And I then have my latest MAC lipstick, which is Velvet Teddy. And then have my three Benefit Balms. So I have Benny Balm, which unfortunately has been a bit destroyed by my brother. But good thing I have a mini. I then have Lolly Balm. Finally, I have my latest edition, which is Posy Balm. Behind that, I have my Essence Liquid Lipstick in the shade Beauty Secret, it was just a really nice pink shade. I have my Revlon Lip Butter in Strawberry Shortcake. I probably should get rid of this as it's quite old. And I also have my Kiko lipstick, which is in 902. And here I have all my Makeup Revolution lipstick. So I just have the shades Dazzle, Flashing, um, Rebel with Cause. I then have the matte shade, which is in Beloved, and I have an MUA lipstick here in Tulip, Wet n Wild lipstick, which is in the shade Breeze, and then have two lipsticks from Cargo. One is like a over top colour, and this one is the red one, which you put on first. So I have a Stradivarius lipstick. This doesn't really have a shade or anything, it's just a small lipstick. Two models own lipsticks. This is shade Eated number two, which is called Stark. Two baby lips here. These are like the tie, whatever you want to call them, ones. And then at the back, I have all my other baby lips, which sadly didn't fit in the other container. So I have the three pop art collections one of the Valentine's Day ones, and just another one of Pink Me Up. Down the side here, I have all my EOS. So I have Pomegranate Raspberry Summer Fruits. I think of this as strawberry sorbet, coconut milk, vanilla mint, blueberry, passion fruit, honeysuckle, honeydew, and the lemon. And here I have some more lip products, which are just more like round shapes. I have the W7 Mega Matte Lips in 2 Bob, my Revlon Lip Gloss in Neutral, the Tanya Burt Lip Gloss in Picnic in the park, my Kylie Jenner lip kit, the actual lip liner, which is a really nice shade. I prefer the shade of the lip liner to the actual thing. Um, I have my Sebamed lip balm. I have a Lancome um, lipstick, and this is in 
April cute. I have many of the Benefit Dandelion lip gloss. I have some, I have a Hollister lip gloss here. I also have a few other lip liners down here from places like Anyway and stuff. Um, but that's really it for that little compartment. Of and this little green pot, I just have two of these Zoella lip balms. I then just have a Nivea lip butter and a Vaseline under there. I also have my Zoella Kissy Messy lip balm and one of the Maybelline um, Baby Lips um, blush and balms. And this one is in flirty pink. I absolutely love this. And back here I have three of the Dr. Paul Paws. If you're wondering what's in the other drawers, there's things like skincare, body care, hair care products, etc. So if you would like an Alex 9 tour, then let me know in the comment section below. I hope you've all enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a massive thumbs up. And if you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Make sure to go and subscribe to my vlog channel too if you haven't already to see more of kind of like my life in a way, more personally. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.